What is happening YouTube, it's your boy Techtrix back with another video and today I'm going to show you how to play GBA games and also having DualShock 4 to control your game. Here we go. First and foremost, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit that notification bell so you can be notified of the next videos to come of tips and tricks on your iPhone and Android. Check out my merch below at 1130.ca. You guys already know that Apple released iOS 13 to iOS devices, and iPhone and iPads and also Apple TVs. And today we're going to show you how you can play GBA games compatible with DualShock 4. First things first, what you want to do is go to settings. We need to pair our DualShock 4 to our iPhone. First, what you need to do is have your iPhone, iPad, or whatever device you're in into tvOS or iOS 13. As of right now, we're on beta 2. I'll link that down below to show you how to get iOS 13 for your iPhone. Once you have iOS 13 on your device, you, you can just go ahead and go to settings and go to Bluetooth. What you want to do is Put your DualShock 4 into pairing mode. To do that, you need to hold the PlayStation button and the share button up there. I, I made a video for this on how to do it perfectly. So I'll link that down below as well. Go ahead and check that out. Once it's connected, as it's shown there, you can get an exit that. Now we're gonna go ahead and open GBA for iOS. I also made a video on how to install this using Tweakbox, but today I'm going to show you how to get it with different apps. What you want to do is go to Safari, go to appvalley.vip, and you want to install the free one right here. Once you've done that, you can go ahead and press allow. Now you can go to settings and go to profiles and device management go to general profiles and device management right here and it should show you the app valley right there you're gonna go ahead and install it up there and press install so you should have it verified just like this once you've done that you can go ahead and open up app valley now there should be an app on your home screen for app valley just like that we can go ahead and open up App Valley, look at the games and the apps. We're gonna go ahead and search up GBA right there. You can try the iOS 11, you can also use the Tela G GBA. But basically, well, how you wanna do this is press get, and then you're gonna press install. I already have it on my device, so I'm not going to press install, but that's basically the gist of it. After you've installed that, you're going to go ahead and go back to Profiles and Device Management, go to Enterprise App, and press Trust. Once you've done that, as you guys can see there, it's going to show Verify, that's GBA for iOS. Once you've done that, then you will be able to open GBA for iOS. Now let's go ahead and open up GBA for iOS. And this is pretty cool. I like how we're able to use a controller now to play any games on, on our iPhone. As of right now, I've, I've used it with Fortnite. I've used it with a GBA for iOS, some emulators. And they all work flawlessly. There's no lag or anything like that. So it's pretty good. Now let's try it out. So basically all we're doing here is testing out the buttons how well it does with emulators and see if there's any lag between them. This is just to show you that the iPhone is compatible with DualShock 4 with all its buttons and its potential. Here we go.
If you're like me and you like playing on emulators just like this one, they have this on-screen controllers that they give you and for me it's harder to play the game because it pulls away from the experience of having it played on a game pad. With this, we'll be able to use the DualShock 4 for a controller which helps us a lot when the game is more critical rather than the Pokemon game. Obviously, Pokemon games are pretty basic on the controls, but if you're playing like Mario, where the controls is needed and it has to be precise, then this is where it's at. Now let's try out a different game, just like Pokemon Emerald. Here we go. Well, that's it for today guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this video make sure to hit that subscribe button below hit that notification bell so you'll be notified in the next videos to come on ios 13 and tips and tricks on your iphone and your android check out my merch below at 1130.ca i hope you guys have a good day comment below what you guys love to play and comment below if it worked with this method as well see you guys next time peace out